Got some more shit to pick up. Yes, I am back. Gonna do some things. Reality doesn't call often, but when it does, I answer. Raiders thought we were easy pickings. We showed them different. What's still I going just, on about these raiders? I just want to trade a few things. Okay. Yeah, well, I wanted to sell some things. What time is it? Ah. All right, throw it in storage for later. Missions. Let me know the if there's anything I can do to lighten the load. Oh, still Barely active. Do you need anything too, Fred? Fuck out of here. Beautiful weather we're having. Oh, hey, uh, I definitely want to veer more south or run into those crazy ass ghouls. Not looking to die. Not today. Really taking a long time to progress in this game. Once I hit level 15, that's going to be a big plateau. Not plateau, but a uh, big, uh, big boost. That would be where it stops. Once I get a specialization and whatever comes along with that. Not to mention the six fucking points for a level. That's it. Just one raider? Body frickin' duh. Ah. Not just one raider. Ones look more dangerous. If I shot you in the head, it would not kill you. Something out there. Oh, does that motherfucker have a stealth boy? Random trader. I'm always open for business. Got those taters on me. Can't buy a goddamn thing. Seen that old sailing ship on top of the building in Charleston? See you around. Should uh, watch out for that raider up ahead. Mm -hmm. 
I'll go ahead and distract them. Turn around before the danger. Someone's coming. What's that? Really, Nick? Nick didn't block that shot, I would have killed him before he hit me. Goddamn companions. Well, I got half a mind to pick up the Lone Wanderer perk. Oh, I should have waited for that provisioner to make things a little easier. Happy trails. Keep going down further. something yeah I am no problem with it that guy is Great. Great. So, uh, this bridge is out of service, apparently. Hmm? 
find me. Just passing through. Just passing through. I think I found another boss. <laughs> I think that's three now I found. Not a bridge you can actually cross, is it? The ammo. I don't think we're alone. On the other hand, they're actually in my way. Yeah, I'm not coming this way again. It's not a good route. Damn near got shot, damn near stepped on a landmine. I'm done with you. Bunker Hill. You there, caravan or raider? Caravan. All right, come on in and set up shop wherever you want. Remember, we get a cut of all your sales. Room and board ain't included. I've been told the Valentine Detective Agency signs are an eyesore. Hey. But they sure bring hey in there. the business. What's up? What a day, huh? Sure love trading here. For trade stuff. <laughs> Don't you have, like, important things to do? Nothing more to say. Nothing more to say. I feel like somebody's watching me. I wish. I would like to make this place my home. Um, are you the doctor? What have you got to trade today? Not the doctor. Wouldn't matter if you were the doctor, I can't afford a doctor. For 10 caps, I can give you the tour. Nobody knows a place like me. Any chance I can get it for free? What? Even I can afford 10 lousy caps. Not interested. <laughs> Your loss. 
magazine up here. Remember that. Who do you think actually won the war? Here, up here, wherever the entrance to the actual monument is. Fuck out my way. I also remember there's something up here you can steal and still aggro them down on the ground. It's kind of ridiculous, considering no way they can see it. Hell yeah. Not enough folks value keeping the old CPU sharp anymore. Really, Nick? Really, Nick? I will dismiss you. And then shoot you. Vegan? Hey, you there. We need to have a conversation. You've got my attention. I'm always looking for people who know how to handle themselves in dangerous situations. From what I hear, you may fit the bill. I don't mind danger, so long as I get paid well enough. You will be well paid. I can promise you that. By the way, I'm Edward Deegan. You'll mostly be working for me. But you'll need to talk to my boss first. His name is Jack Cabot. He likes to personally interview everyone I hire. He's careful like that. Come down to Cabot House in Beacon Hill and ask to talk to Jack. I'll let him know you're coming. No need to loot this place. I mean, eventually I own it. That's a big eventually. Let's do this. Really? What? This fucking game. I shouldn't have looted that shit. It's that gl same glitchy shit has happened to me before. And I did it again. At least I'm heading somewhere where I can pick up a new companion. They can get McCready out the gate. I don't think I have to do anything. Follow the main road, I'll get there. With McCready on my side, I can do what I actually want to do. Say the kind of things I want to say. He enjoys a smart ass and he enjoys a thief. And I am both. Is this where the comic shop is? No. Where that is, though. Unidentified intruder detected. Beginning search.
there's landmines as well around here. Other dangers like that. No, 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 no. I hate this fucking maze of a city. Hunters over here. There's raiders on this fucking bridge. Three factions here ready to fucking gangbang me. Be right on top of one of the entrances, but I can't remember the exactness of how to get in. Walk around this building here. Or about 60 meters. Ooh. Pretty killable group. Nothing. What the fuck? Mouse. Around my 
my neck! You humans made us! Now suffer for your arrogance! Fair enough. side. Myself a little bit trapped. Wanted to take a little trip to good neighbor. Good neighbor has a lot of bad neighbors. Rules are the safest fucking path. Looking at the right entrance, right? Looking at where I need to be. It was nothing. Zombie prick. Poisoned. In fact, I am. Was. Take a moment, relax, get my head together, stop doing dumb shit. killed shit instead of running like a fucking pussy I actually would have been better off oh panicky Pete is not serving me well there's that fucking super mutant I know this place is very close to the entrance walk past it like every time you leave the place same with that thing Pretty much down that street and to the right. Oh. What's up? <sighs> oh, 
to your pretty little face. Coming back to me. No one. Fuck. I hear something. Nothing. Mark these guys before I started shooting at them. Someone there. All through the floor. the entrance. Like I said, I just need to kill my way through things. Instead of running like a bitch. Can I not see this one? Okay. Dick. Something there. Get it. I hear something. Why will this not? I'm having a clipping issue or something. One more try. Different angle. Invincible. Those guys I killed.
I made that far more difficult than it had to be. Got a loading screen, check that messages. That was thoroughly unimpressive. Oh, impressive how bad I went. Hey, hold up there. First time in good neighbor? You can't go walking around without insurance. You better back off, or you're the one who's gonna need insurance. Well, well hey, all right. We'll just say your insurance is paid up for now, okay? Whoa, 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 time out. Someone steps through the gate the first time, they're a guest. You lay off that extortion crap. What do you care? She ain't one of us. No love for your mayor, Finn. I said let her go. You soft hand cop. You keep letting outsiders walk all over us. One day, there'll be a new man. Come on, man. This is me we're talking about. Let me tell you something. <laughs> now, why'd you have to go and say that, huh? Breaking my heart over here. Now I know you... Bad old Finn handle back there, but a mayor's got to make a point sometimes. You all right? You killed him. Got a good pair of eyes on you. I think you'll fit in here. Good neighbors of the people, for the people. You feel me? Everyone's welcome. Of the people, for the people. Oh, brother. <laughs> I can tell I'm gonna like you already. Just consider this town your home away from home. So long as you remember who's in charge. Who's in charge? Charles? Hey. 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 What's up? What a day, huh? Everyone's welcome and good neighbor. Even me. Don't you have, like, important things to do? Hell of a load you're carrying. Better sell some to Daisy Nothing before someone to say. swipes it. Sweet pip boy, sister. You hold on to that. Oh, Deacon. He gets around. Alright, let's go to the bar. I had someone to meet. Hancock says newcomers are welcome in the third rail. Go on in. Hey, look, it's Wonder Woman. See you looking round. Can't say I'm surprised uh, to find Yeah, that's a uh, voice by Linda so Carter, who is Wonder Woman. Track me down with, and huh? also married to one of the lead people at Bethesda. Should we take this outside? It ain't like that. I'm just here to deliver a message. In case you forgot, I left the gunners for good. Yeah, I heard. But you're still taking jobs in the Commonwealth. That isn't going to work for us. I don't take orders from you. Not anymore. So why don't you take your girlfriend and walk out of here while you still can? What? Winlock, tell me we don't have to listen to this shit. Listen up, McCready. The only reason we haven't filled your body full of bullets is that we don't want to be good. See, we respect other people's boundaries. We know how to play the game. It's something you never learned. Oh shit, you got to pay him to recruit him. <laughs> have money. You can play the tough guy all you want. But if we hear you're still operating inside gunner territory, all bets are off. You got that? You finished? Yeah. We're finished. Come on, Barnes. Look, lady. If you're preaching about the Adam or looking for a friend, you've got the wrong guy. You need a hired gun. Then maybe we can talk. I'm interested. If you think you've got what it takes. You're joking, right? I've been doing this since I was a kid. I know my way around. I used to run with the gunners, for God's sake. You're acting like I'm supposed to know what you're talking about. Maybe it's better that you don't. I want to stink of Winlock and Barnes rubbing off on me and scaring away my business. Now what about you? How do I know I won't end up with a bullet in my back? You don't. That's part of the risk, right? Can't argue with that. I'll tell you what. The price is 250 caps. Up front. 
There's no room for bargaining. What do you say? How about a hundred? Sorry. I don't do charity work. Come back when you've got the caps, and maybe we can make a deal. Okay, I got a hundred. Well, you got enough shit to sell. I think I do. I've got a few minutes to browse. Don't bother tipping. Already overcharged. <laughs> drug service neglecting to use. Pull the mod off that. Charlie. What will it be? Cause I'm the one Who's the singer? That is Magnolia. The flower of the thing. Now, you gonna order? Sure. Let's take a look. Don't bother tipping. You ready to hear about her job? Were you turning up your nose to a bit of violence? Sounds like it's up my alley. I got a certain anonymous client who Paying top dollar for a cleanup job. Three locations. Everyone inside. No witnesses. Only catch? It's all in town. The old warehouses, so I can't use my regulars. Too noticeable. That's where you come in. The job's 200 caps. Payment after it's done. And don't worry. I'll know when it is. Three locations? That's a lot of time. A lot of bullets. Well, I guess we could sweeten the pot a bit. Two fifty. I don't do work, unless I know who's paying the bills. All right, Gov. Not like it's a big secret who I represent. Mayor Ann Cock is fronting the caps. Internal political struggle. You know how it is. Look, it's nothing you need to be concerned about. Just clear out. Too low. Barely covers the risks. All right, Gov. Three hundred. I'll get it done. You better. Now go out there and bust some air. Have McCurdy first, he likes when I haggle. I don't know what you're looking for. <laughs> well, Excuse me, miss. Hmm? Well, what's the matter, sweetheart? Don't tell me you didn't like the song. I just wanted to talk to you. Hmm. Well, I thought that's what we were doing. Now, there's something special about you, isn't there? Don't tell me. Let me guess. You're a survivor, aren't you? I bet the whole world could stand in your way and you'd just keep going. So what brings a woman like you to my part of town? I came here for the music. <laughs> Flatterer, I think you and I are going to get along. So it's my turn to answer questions, right? What can I do for you? I was wondering if we could get to know each other better. Oh, really? Go on. You, me, an evening walk under the streetlights. And then what? Music. And then I failed the fucking check. <laughs> it's tempting, but unfortunately I'm married to the stage. Keep your eyes I'm not sleeping with her today. Friendly advice. Sell some more shit. Come back and grab Mac. Come on.
Ghost of City, you can load it. It's not that hard. Hey everyone, gather around. Let's kick the breeze back. Shoot the fan. Hey, so on. Now I know you The Diamond City Radio thing, signal but comes alive. I don't want to forget what matters. That's hey, Travis. Daisy. Glad you could be on it. How's my favorite girl doing? Didn't I see you on a date with Morowski the other day? Huh. He wishes. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right. We're getting off track. What was I saying? Oh, that's right. What matters? We freaks gotta stick together. And the best way to stick together. Hey. That's it. Hmm. Notice me. What's up? Need a place to stay? Try Hotel Rex. Well, hello. Everything here is guaranteed to injure, maim, or kill at your discretion. Except me. I only kill when I want to. Sure. Let's take a look. Purchase a variety in case of boredom. I look like I'm missing some of my armor. Seriously? Did I sell my fucking armor that I'm wearing? Great, now I gotta figure out where my fucking armor is. Hopefully it's just at the bar. Hopefully you'll sell it back to me at a decent price. I believe I sold my goddamn armor. Downstairs. Don't bother the other patrons. You're blocking my light, Dal. Charlie. You'll be coming quite a regular. Well, the beer still tastes the same. 
like shit. I've got a few minutes. Nothing watered down. All right, at least it's only 33 caps. Looks like, like we've got another freak, just won't fit anywhere else. Spill it. Buddy. You still looking for work, McCready? That depends. You ready to fork over 250 caps? Everything's negotiable. Would you take 200? You drive a hard bargain. But you just bought yourself an extra gun. All right, boss. Let's get out of here. Woohoo! Hey. What do you want? Free water. Yes. Hey, I just Magnolia. take something off the table. Something I can do for you, gorgeous. One in round two. Whoa! Any chance I could steal you away for an evening? I don't think that would be it. What's your story? Oh, I flew into town like any songbird does on a heavy wind with a wounded wing. Mm, well, this place has a stage. I needed to sing. And Whitechapel Charlie needed customers, so... I hate it when your gun are. just goes off. Is there anything else? I wouldn't mind hearing another song. A good musician listens to her audience. How about this one? Yeah? Huh? Don't have no hand out. I get cute. Buddy McCready's got a rep here in Good Neighbor. Bad attitude, good aim. Ever been to kill or be killed? Some fine looking weapons. Can't believe it. He looked just Why like Sammy, too. Yeah, sure as hell didn't act like him. Institute thinks they can replace people with synths in this town? They got another thing coming. I was just talking what to his son. Tell his mother. Sweet pit boy, sister. You hold on to that. Smell that? That's freedom. Running from something? Welcome home. I think the chem dealer here has a quest for me. Red, are you going to hang out in the lobby all day again? Or are you actually going to go down and do some work? Being available to the customers is work. It's not all about cooking chems, Claire. It's not all about sampling those chems either. Maybe if you stop using, you can focus. What? Where's the fun in cooking it if you ain't using it? My mistake. Oh man, someone new! You need some jet man, home brewed, reasonable prices? Do you have any work? Yeah, actually, you might be perfect. You know the gun, oh, I am pretty right? perfect. The high end mercenaries? Well, a few of them were talking about scavenging around that old hallucinogen building. I mean, just think about that name. There's got to be some shit there that's out of this world. You get me something, I pay you 200 caps. Your offer's a little low, Fred. All right, let's make it 250. Not good enough. You said there's already a crew of mercs there. Oh, I see where this is going. Job's going to be 200 caps, no haggling. All right, Fred, we have a deal. You're the best, the absolute best. Before you even start, let's get to the point. We have rooms, one room specifically. Payment due up front. I don't think so. Mark another in the looter column. 
I just clean up around here. Had a bandage in it. Pretty rare. Let's not press my luck. Sweet. Go into the memory den yet? I don't think. Oh, yeah, there is Silver Shroud. Need to sell some junk? Head to Daisy's discounts. You got the memory pod loaded up? Oh, you're not Irma. <clears throat> Good neighbor's crazy. Thefts, murders, worse. Sometimes you just gotta escape a little to make it through the day. I hear you. It's a mess out there. It's rough in the best of days. B but now, you ever listen to the Silver Shroud? Huh. That's what we need. No matter how bleak things got, he saved the day. My family and I used to listen to every new episode. You mean when they first aired? How? The last broadcast was hundreds of years ago. So, I'm a time traveler. I just got back from visiting George Washington. Now you're just playing with me. Though that would be pretty neat. You know what would be even neater? What if the Silver Shroud was real? With his black trench coat and gleaming silver submachine gun? I got a plan to bring him to life. So we can fight bad guys and give the rest of us a symbol of something better. Sure, Kent. You have a plan, all right. I know how it sounds. I've built my own custom machine gun. Even better than the one in the show. But to make this work, I still need the most important piece. The genuine Silver Shroud costume herself. And they actually got one here in Boston. They made it for the TV show. Will you help? I might do it, if you make it worth my while. I can give you some caps up front. Just promise you'll help me. I'll get the costume for you. You're gonna do this? For real? Before the bombs fell, they were filming the Silver Shroud pilot over at Hubris Comics. So that's where you'll find it. You're the best. The Pardon memory den's not accepting new clients right now, sweetheart. Not fucking around with stealing. Not that desperate for money. Base is hungry from lack of food. Hey, you. Looking for work? Depends on the work. You'll never find a more fair and honest job. If you don't mind a little manual labor, 
and don't ask too many questions, you're in. I'll give you 50 caps to start. Interested? You can do better than that. Fine. Take a hundred up front. This is just a bad deal. Trust me, there will be much more later on. Just take the 50 caps. I'm gonna need more to go on here. There's a project I'm working on. A big one. One that could get me into lots of trouble if the wrong person finds out. So a little discretion is called for. I got a delicate house of cards going here. You know? I'm in. That's what I like to hear. Let's go inside. I'll give you the lowdown. Picking up that here. Not much, but it's up for grabs. Gotta find the terminal. This is beyond me. Ready to get to work? No, I followed you down here for the exercise. Funny. Well, you'll get plenty of exercise here. You are gonna be doing some digging. Digging? <sighs> this is a waste of my talents. <laughs> you want a better job? You gotta work your way up to it, buddy. Show me that can-do attitude. The other two are down there digging already. Go give them a hand, will you? Fire alerts. I think this rifle should do fine at dispatching them. Probably should have saved at that mattress before coming down here. Hey, I think we can finally get through. Wanna see what's on the other side? Oh yeah. You think Bobby will pay us this week? I don't know, man. It's starting to feel like a different charity. Did you just hear something? It's crawling with my alerts! This job and shove it. Good luck down there, new girl. Isn't there like real Meyer Lurks down here? Like a Meyer Lurk King, even? Those 
I might not want to actually fuck with now that I'm thinking of it. Things run away. Let down. Run away, too, buddy. Oh, really? Where the fuck did he go? Glitch somewhere. Or found a really good hiding spot. Safety off. I think we have company. Yeah, must have glitched somewhere. Otherwise, it don't make no sense. Leaving and coming back in. If that fixes it. What are you doing talking to me? Do something! Love to and all, but oh, buddy, buddy's corpse got in my way. Uh oh, go and no more disappearing act. Take him down. Damn, now he's just starting to have fun. What is going on in my tunnel? Looks like we are having crab for dinner tonight. You'd eat Mirelurk? Ugh, no. Disgusting. Tough, but somehow slimy at the same time. Well, you stuck around at least. So I guess you're promoted. You get to be my new gun. I think we just need one more guy. 
an old friend. He'll want a fair cut, but we saw what being cheap got me. That means less caps for me. Yes, it does. There's still plenty to go around in that strong room. Don't you worry. First, I think it's best if you actually see what we're after. I have some things to check on in Diamond City. Head over to the noodle shop there, and I'll meet you when I finish up my business. Somebody just woke up. Don't make me carry that worthless crap. Kitty's doing her wake up stretches. Up. Oh. Time no see. Now either she's going to go for food or she's going to go for petting. Whenever she gets up, she wants one of the two. Yeah? Hey. Huh? Look, I don't like to brag, but I'm a lover of hey the fighter. Oh, you know what new I'm face saying? walks into my store, and you're not even screaming yet. Very polite. You let me know if anything catches your fancy. Got any work? I do, actually. Super mutants have taken over the old Boston Public Library. I got a lot of fond memories of that place from when I was a girl and human. You get those lumbering brutes out of there, I'll pay you 200 caps. I don't think that's enough money to cover clearing out a whole building. You got a good point. We'll make it uh, 250 caps. Hey, it's not just the cost of ammunition. Danger means doctor's fees. Look, I've been shilling deals for two centuries, and you just overplayed your hand. The job's 200 caps. Take it or leave it. You got a deal, Daisy. Thanks. Hey, while you're there, could you return this book for me? It's from the library. Don't even ask how long it's been overdue. <laughs> hey, Daisy. If you hit upon something, don't bother telling me it's an heirloom. I'm probably older than whatever it is you're selling. I've got a few minutes to browse. Everything's guaranteed to last. Until it doesn't. I would gladly take being one of those ugly things to live forever. Personally. Hmm. I don't know that I have enough. It would be awkward fighting with a rifle inside, but... As they ain't crazy overpowered guys. Hmm. 
someone's got a beat on us. <sighs> got a nice pair of cement shoes for you. That's just great. Shouldn't hide. Ain't very courageous of you. I mean, there's one entrance. You know where I came in. Come out, and I'll do you quick. Fuck you. sure that was a double hit through the leg and into that dude's head. What the fuck? They can shoot me but I can't shoot them? Let's try. Fuck you. What is with this garbage? Fucking clip. Can't take the floor. Where'd she go? Through that fucking hole. Which one of you lost her, huh?
fraidy cat. Too scared? Every second you hide, I just get madder. Much hiding is waiting. Come down, I'll fight you. You don't come down, I'll bandage. Come out, and I'll do you quick. Minute man. A little quicker, holy shit. Scratch one off. The list ran off. Oh. Wait a minute. What's the point of picking up that junk? There you are. Wait. Screw up at some point, then I got you. Uh oh. Uh oh. Something's fucking frozen. Holy fuck, don't tell me. All that progress lost. Son of a bitch game. Unfreeze. I'm gonna go punch something. Seriously. Mouse ain't moving. Great. So, that's what... An uh, hour and a half fucking wasted. <laughs> Bitch. Alright, well I guess I'm taking a break from Fallout for a while, cause... Yeah, fuck that shit. What, the second time in this run-through that's happened? Not to mention all the other glitches. The fucking bullshit of the survival mode is the glitches. It's not- the survival itself is not difficult. Surviving with glitches is difficult. Fuck this game. 